No, I've got that there, Tiger. <laughs> you're welcome to stay up. How long do you reckon? About an hour. Mm. Yeah, yeah, you're live. Um, Kitty. Oh, that's funny. No, that is always nice. fine. Go out the back stairs. Back stairs? Didn't even know. <laughs> um, it's finished, Kitty. Okay, you're obviously fucking. I've got Kitty there. Hello. I um, oh, oh, I'm so sorry. We set up the computer completely um, different. I have to bring everything in and it's just like you're just playing up. But I got you. Do let me know in the comments if you can hear me, if you can see me. And hopefully all the tech is working and we are live everywhere. Um, can I get the confirmation, Simon, that we are live in all, all the places? Yes, he's got the thumbs up for me. Good morning. <laughs> How are you? Tuesday morning. I can't believe today has been, today is the day. Today is our one year anniversary. Like we've been going live for a year, a whole year. And what a year has it been? We have had so much fun exploring all sorts of different techniques. We, we have been using all sorts of different beads, different color schemes, different, like all sorts of different things. And it's just like, I don't know, it <laughs> it's quite emotional. It was a, a, a bit overwhelming this morning when I was like sort of thinking about it. But what I love about the most is the community we built and we've been there for each other and everybody is being like supportive and people been texting each other. I know uh, somebody who texts the link every single morning to somebody else, an elderly lady who, who, who like not that good with technology. So you've been helping out each other so, so much. <laughs> happy, happy first anniversary for everybody. Um, hopefully there's many more years to come and um, we like to, you know, we like to be with you and, and as long as you turn up and watch us, we will turn up and show you all sorts of different techniques. So, let me know in the comments how this one year has been for you. What has been the best bit? What has been your favorite, favorite technique? What was, uh, what, um, what you learned most what is there anything what you want us to do moving forward just sort of let us know there's a lot of questions actually let's back up <laughs> so like in one sentence it's a lot of questions so let me know in the uh, what was the best technique you learned last year um, and he's saying good morning kitty and everyone first time i've been able to watch live um in a while i hope everything is okay happy live anniversary yes everything we are of, of, everything is cool good we feel amazing this is like you know it just we made it one year like well last year when we started on 23rd of march i never thought <laughs> so a year later we're gonna be still doing it because we really just wanted to um, help out in the community and <laughs> oh, can we just sing everything? <laughs> oh, bless you. We just really wanted to help out in the community and like sort of entertain you wh while the difficult times and like we just really like grew with it. The whole community is grew with us. Now, I would like you to, Simon, can you go into position, please? <laughs> I would like you to, like you never see Simon behind the scenes. So um, I'm going to, you take your mask off or something. We do have to wear a mask. You take your chin chin mask off. Chin diaper. Chin diaper. Okay, take your chin diaper off. So without further ado, I'm going to introduce Simon. There we go. You need this to go that way a bit, lovely. M a bit more, a bit more. <laughs> we, we, we rehearsed this. We rehearsed this and we said to him, like, oh, that's where I need you to stand. Everybody can see you. So why say hello. Good morning, everyone. Um, can you hear? Can you let me know if you hear Simon very well? We we are having a new um, microphone as well, so I'm hoping that you can hear him loud and clear as well. So Simon, tell us a bit about yourself. How long have you been in the bead business? Oh, well, I've been in the bead business too many years now, if you ask me. <laughs> I only came on to help out for just six months. 
um, we, when she started the business and wanted to grow a bit more. And I said, I'll give you six months. You know, I left my other job and I'll go back into accounting. And um, that was uh, 16 years ago now, I think, nearly. Yeah. Um, and uh, yeah, I haven't got back to my accounting job yet. I'm still trying to get there. Um, <laughs> I don't so think you one, ever one day go I'll back. go back. <laughs> if you stop buying the beads, I can go back and do it. But, um, yeah, no, that's just that. And I just love it. It's, it's good. I used to do all the exhibitions, go all around the country every week. Um, met a lot of you out there already. Um, and it's a great fun place to, it's a great place to work. So anybody who doesn't know, so I'm, I'm more the sort of the creative part of the business and Simon is the man <laughs> who makes everything work. He's the one who will do invoicing. He's the one who will look after the website. He's the one who like hold everything together. I just come up with all these crazy ideas and play with my beads and, and, and he's the one really behind the scenes who is the most important person, I guess. But like when you pick up the phone, you will talk to either him or you will talk to Blake and he really is there to... Um, Oh, Lucy's saying, I think you could earn an amazing team. Oh, thank you, um, Lucy. Um, Natalie's saying, I love you, are a husband and a wife team and work well together. I think like we are talk I was talking to somebody about this the other week that like we sort of mold each other because Simon is so good like with financing is and stuff like that so I don't have to worry about that but then I'm quite creative so he doesn't have to be worried about that either so I think we complete each other in a in a way oh Gillian is an excellent customer service the the comments are coming in so fast I can't um oh, you push make them all to them oh <laughs> make them blush everybody's saying good morning Simon you make a great team Betty's saying as well um, Kitty is the one who just wants an excuse for a huge beading stash. That's absolutely right. The warehouse. Sun is the one who makes it to uh, pay. Exactly. You are absolutely right there. Um, Miriam is saying it has been a really strange year and I think that all your hard work with the lives kept us sane. So I'm sure we all thank you, both Sarah's and Totally Beads team for the bottom of our hearts. Oh, bless you. Thank you so much for the kind words, Miriam. Um, nice to put a face to the name, um, Sandra is saying. Simon, excellent work from all the team at Totally Beads. Um, good morning, Simon and Kitty and everybody. So, Simon, what is your favourite beads? Because, like, you know me, I like all colours and everything else. My favourite beads? We didn't rehearse it. I didn't ask, I, I didn't tell him I'm going to ask him all these questions. Beads. My favourite beads are the hematite beads, actually. They're my favourite beads. They're the beads that I like to buy myself a lot of the time. A lot of the time, Kitty does look at the hematite beads, but... I'm the one who's got a close relationship with the hematite supplier. So I'm the one buying a lot of the hematite bees all, all the time. So they're probably my favourite one. Probably the ones that we've stocked for the longest. Yeah. And um, yeah, that's my favourite to buy. How many years ago have you been working with that factory? Mm. Quite a lot. 2006. So yes. 15 years. I was pregnant with Lucy then. Now this is the thing, like when you have children, you think about like, oh, well, I, I did that since I, was, we were, since I was pregnant with my daughter and my daughter is 13. So <laughs> like you quite sort of can backwards like that. She's going to be 14 in a couple of weeks. That's her 14 going on 40, I guess. <laughs> um, well, is, have you got any tips for us or anything you would like to say to the ladies? No, I just thank you for your support this last year. It's been a really tough year, I know, for everyone. Um, but I'm glad that we've been able to come to you most days live. Um, it is a lot of work and Kitty puts a lot more work behind the scenes than I ever do nowadays. Um, um, but oh. we just want to thank you for everything you've done for us this year. Um, it's kept <laughs> us going and, um, and we hope that we can just bring you more great deals. I got Kieran is asking you a question. Is it possible to do a live and make a men's bracelet? I, I think we need to get Simon on live making a men's bracelet. I haven't bracelet. done jewelry making for a very, very good <laughs> few years now. The last time I did it was about four years ago when I was doing the show. I train you. Mm, <laughs> we train him. We train him up. Right. Okay. So yesterday, and I, I want you to stay for this. Oh. <laughs> you can't go. Yesterday, um, I came in and I, I was, it was my day at the warehouse and we were like looking at like what but Simon already made like a list of things what he what offers and bits of pieces he wanted to do today so <laughs> I came in and I said like oh can we have a look at like you know what are you been preparing and he was like oh I was preparing this and this and this and this <laughs> And I said, to, and I said, I was like, well, what offers are we going to do? And he said, like, oh, well, you know, we can do like 20% of this and maybe like 25% of that. And I said to him, uh-uh, uh-uh, it's not good enough. <laughs> no, Simon. Yes. <laughs> so I went like 
what I really want to do, and I, like I changed everything, like I would, <laughs> the last last minute, so everybody say yes, I want Simon for a tutorial. <laughs> I changed everything in the last minute and what I really wanted to put together is bundles for you. So um, I looked back and I cherry picked a few, well not cherry picked because what I put together will be good for a lot of different techniques. What we covered the last year and I said to Simon, I, I want <laughs> I want a really good discount on this because I think it's a one year anniversary. We really have to, we really want to help you out um, as much and you know, when what we put together you can go back months and months and months and just make and make and make so without further ado i'm going to say goodbye for simon for a second like isn't it amazing i'll go back to check your isn't it amazing so we got two cameras one pointing sort of my way and the other camera is pointing the other side of the warehouse everybody else is scattered <laughs> they, they're all down the aisles i might have to go after them at like <laughs> and chase them everybody's working everywhere else everybody's like oh, i don't want to I was, I was talking to blake and i said blake will you come and say hi i said yeah i'll come and say hi and this morning it was like mm, i'm not really too sure and i said to chloe chloe will you come and say hi? I was like oh i don't know <laughs> <laughs> Everybody Hello. else. So I, I, I can't make them to come and say hi. But anybody, if you want to come and say hi, please do because you are the team behind. No, they, they're, they're all shy. They're, no, all shy. they're all shy. Oh no, Gabby's going to come. Gabby's going to Gabby's going to come and say hello. If you go around the other side, lovely. So this, this, uh, meet Gabriella. Say hello. Hi everybody. My name is Gabriella. I'm working at the Top Tally Beats. About So, so Gabby is the one who will like when the orders come through, she will take the sheets and pick everything and pull it, uh, pull it all together. We might have my see <laughs> Adam walking in the bus. No, he's he's taking the long way. Yes, <laughs> a bit so you can see he's a little bit. Everybody's a little bit shy. <laughs> if you say like, oh, I I haven't washed my hair, <laughs> I was like, no, you're fine. <laughs> Oh, here's Blake. Come on, come on, Blake. Come on, say hello. 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 Hold on, let me just move it. He's, he's gonna. <laughs> he's, he, he's 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 moving already. Right. Okay. Sorry, I go back to pick the. Right. Gabby's gonna go back to pick the order. So we say goodbye to Gabby. Right. I'm gonna go down and I'm gonna show you the amazing bundles he put together, um, for you. There we go. So, when I was thinking yesterday that um what do you really need when you want to make more than one technique so we're talking about hugs and kisses or even if you just want to make something really basic like an elastic bracelet or if you want to do something a bit more you need some seed beads or like you know what class do you want to use i wanted to put in some um more sort of basic uh, not basic more sort of like lobster class like which is like you can have in quantity and i wanted to put some magnetic clasp in there as well so you can make those special uh, makes <laughs> so i'm gonna bring the very first one in and this one is called the rose gold so what i put together and you can check these out on the website let me just mm -hmm. You might have to move this a bit because you won't be able to see all of them at once. So each one of the bundles and <laughs> I went, I did go crazy. I did go crazy yesterday. Uh, Simon said like do six colors max, but you know me, I couldn't do just six colors. I had to do more than six colors. If I just move it that way a little bit, I know it might not be straight on the screen. We will be able to see more of it. Right, is my camera is gonna stay? Hold on, guys. There we go. So I'm just gonna come back to this so you can see more of the tray as well. So what I really wanted to do is to put together um, glass beads, like the six and eight millimeter size. I wanted to put together crystals so you can like make them together. I wanted to add seed beads in there as well so you got size six you got size eight size 11 i wanted to give you a bunch of rat tail i wanted to give you oh <laughs> elastic if you want to do elastic i wanted to give you tiger tail so you can do all sorts of copper jewelry you could do like basic stringing you could do all sorts of different things mm -hmm. there is your magnetic clasp i put two of the larger one and three of the smaller one in there 
Let me just, I'm going to flip the camera in a minute because it's upside down for me. And then, like, you got your normals. You got your colors, you got eye pins, you got hat pins, you got cream beads, you got um, your lobster clasp, you got your air wires, and you got your jump rings. So, there are 14 strands of beads in there in total. You got a whole set of findings. You got three different sizes of seed beads. You got tiger tail, you got elastic oh also you got a reel of supalon and then you got a rat tail but what i did what i wanted to make sure all of this is color coordinated for you so everything what you see there is like it's it's gonna nicely together so you can create really nice pieces of jewelry i just really really love it i called this colorway rose gold we got 14 colorways to look at in total and are really amazing i was there for about five hours yesterday putting these colors together and sam was like oh come on you haven't finished yet and i was like yeah but they're so nice colors <laughs> they, they really need to they re really need to sort of think it through and I would go backwards and forwards and, and take a crystal out and put another color in and then take another one out and put another one in. I would be going like like backwards and forwards a lot, a lot with it, but I'm really happy what I put together. So this is the rose gold and then I'm going to show you all the other ones um, coming along. Now, before actually I move on to the rose gold, I want to tell you the price because adding all of these bits of pieces together, especially the findings, they're like, you know, one pound fifty a pack, but how many have you got? The clasp, they are a pound each day, two pound, you know, adding everything up together and all the crystals, all the glass beads, it comes um, to 50 pounds. <laughs> and I said to Simon, like, we need the best offer we can do for these because I really want to um, give you back some of the support, um, some of the support what you given us last year. So we dropped it down to half price. So 24.99, you're gonna get 14 strands of uh, beads you're gonna get seed beads you're gonna get your findings and like if you never had like even all the offers we did we never had the findings these are full full pack of findings from the website at half price so it's a really really good deal so if you want this is uh, this will be good for multiple mics and you will be you will be able to do all sorts of different things with it right so this is the rose gold i added like burgundy and uh, pinks and this is like sort of a little bit of a corally color i really do love it now i'm going to move on to the next color because i got quite a few um to cover is that the, not the rose this is the rose, rose gold the that's the rose gold yes right i love this one this one is another one, but before i just give me one sec i'm going to flip the camera and i'm going to zoom out as much as i can to give us more to more space right this is the black diamond so again the, your findings is going to be exactly the same in each one of the kits you get hat pins you get eye pins so you can do beaded chain and i didn't tell you the best part of it all <laughs> um you're gonna get lobster clasps you're gonna get your cream beads you're gonna get your clots you also gonna get your jump ring, so you can. That's that's enough for like making ten bracelets, necklaces, whatever you would like to make. Hat pins, eye pins. You get a whole bag of air wires in here. Now for the black diamond, I added the rhodium color. For the rose gold, I add the rose gold findings. Again, you're gonna get your magnetic clasp in here. So the uh, the phone is gonna go. Simon's gonna have to go and get it. Um, you're gonna get exactly the same amounts in each one of those kits what we'll be wearing is your crystals and your glass beads now some of the colorways like we'll have smaller crystals and some of the colors will have larger crystals or the glass beads as well some of them will have more six millimeter and some of them will have more eight millimeter colors in there because i didn't want to go so much on the size i wanted to go on the color so you have um you you have got like everything together to make beautiful jewelry as well. Again, Superlon and a rat tail. I mean, look at that rat tail. Even if you just wanted to make some simple macaroni bracelets, you could use any of those glass beads on there in the middle. I think that would look great. Um, elastic, tiger tail, and your seed beads, of course. You got the seed beads in there is Toho seed beads. And of course, we got, this is the best quality we do. And there is size six, size eight, and size 11. So each one of these kits, it's going to be exactly the same so 14 strands of crystals now if you see the crystal is a little bit smaller in this this pack because um but still get a full strand 
because th those are the colors which is going best with this black diamond and i love mixing sort of minky um sort of darker beige colors with grays because i think then when you mix colors like that you can have you can wear it with so many different tops right so i'm bringing in the next one and this one oh let's do this one let's do the monochrome quickly so the monochrome is coming with black findings because i wanted to take it more towards sort of sort of the black you got a couple of white ones in there you got some grays there is two different tones of gray so this one is like got a tiny bit of green in it it's a little bit more a warmer tone of green of gray <laughs> and um, they got like more like silver grays in there as well and of course you got like hematite and black colorways as well so because of as i was matching up the crystals i found some larger ones which they were matching sort of this color theme and i and i put it in there so don't forget each one of these kits if i added all the components up separately they would be 50 pounds and we're doing them for 24.99 today and this offer is actually this valid until tomorrow because what's going to be happen i have pulled out a lot of stock to put these together and we're only doing this once so i'm going to show you all the colorways now <laughs> and then what we're going to do we're going to wait until tomorrow afternoon and see we, we didn't want to we didn't want to sort of limit how many you can offer because when we started out and when we started talking about it we were like oh well i'll maybe make 20 of each color and that's it because i ended up with 14 colors you know me and then um I said, well, we can't really because some people are not watching it live and they might miss out. So what, what we decided in the end that uh, we are going to wait until tomorrow night. That will be the cutoff point to, uh, to take an advantage of this deal. And then once once we, the deal is finished tomorrow night, then on Thursday, I'm in the warehouse all day. And I will personally go and make sure that these kits are put together. So each one of, one of these colors are going to go really nicely. Right look at this i love this one this one is the red now red is sometimes it's a little bit hard to um to put together or red is hard to work with because when you're matching red up like you need to either multi-use the red so like oh, you need like three different shades of red in a necklace because when you want to wear this with your red top if it's not exactly the right um shade it won't look as nice so what i love doing with red is i always i multi-tone it so when i make a necklace i would use like for example those three together these three together and then i could wear it with a lighter darker or even a darker red top as well but again you got your crystals you got your uh, glass beads you got 14 strands of glass uh, glass crystals and glass beads in there you got your seed beads you got size six size eight size 11 you got your findings <laughs> i'm not going to pick up all the findings for every single one of them but again hat pin eye pin air wire lobster jump ring clot and cream beads and this one with the red i added rose gold because i think that just goes perfectly with it and red tail you got your cyclone you got your magnetic class they all sticking together and then you have got your elastic as well in there so i did a point eight in there which is sort of a medium side elastic right next one <laughs> oh this color so this color this this is this is this is this is such a nice color i put like lay yellows and mustards together so in end we like we called it honeybee but at one point like aka this color is also known as a blakey color because he, he loves all these colors um together so we got like beiges we got yellows and we got like a couple of olive colors as well and what i did here is i added darker seed beads with it so it's really going to show up when you make something with it and you will be able to like you know really mix it together but like i'm not a yellow person and i have to say that like i don't really uh, i don't think i got a, ye a yellow piece of clothes or a yellow top i think i got one mustard uh color top but I'm, I'm, I really like the colors together because I think like it's mixing them together. It's like when, you, when you're working with colors, all of a sudden if you, if you use those pages, like let's say we're using those pages, if I add a yellow into the mix, all of a sudden it just really brightens that colorway up and it just makes it more like sort of like a, um, 
I don't know how I can explain it the best, but it gives me like a happy feeling. So this is the honeybee. And this one, I put the champagne findings with it. Again, get exactly the same findings, what you get in the other ones. You get air wires, you get head pin, eye pin, you get um, lobsters, creams, clots, and jump rings. Also, you get your tiger tail. Um, you get your Supilon, I got brain dead there for a second. <laughs> and I tried the Supilon to match the Supilon to the seed beads itself. Um, your clasp and a really lovely mustard color rat tail here. So again, you could do macrame bracelets, you could do multi layer tiger tail ones, you could do like, you know, when we did the four core jewelry, so use one, one um, bead on the uh, in the middle and then split it into three and just add some crystals or smaller bits of pieces in it and there is your and i'm going to tell you the best best part just in a minute what what we come up with and what we are going to if you buy any of these kits you're going to have <laughs> what you're going to have oh after that after that yellow have a look at this one now i call this one sunset <laughs> joe's saying love them all help well, if you if you are going to like if you can like go for a couple of colors because like we're not going to do like another offer like this because it's, it's not that because we like, you know, it by one uh, because of the discount, we can't offer to always give away like big discount like this. But two, this is a tenderous amount of work to put these bundles together. So each would like if you think about it, like just finding lies, you got seven bags of findings in there. Now each one of those bags have to be measured out separately. You got um, the, the glass beads in that each one of those strands has to be knotted separately at the end and then put together. So we're going to spend, but <laughs> everybody in the warehouse is going to probably spend Thursday putting these kits together for you. I love this colorway again. Again, like this is the thing. I'm not an orange person, but I love, love, love the look of this so much that, um, I don't know. I, 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 it just, it just, it just makes me smile because, and we are like adding lighter and darker colors together it just really it really highlights it so I, I i love it now for this one i have added the gold findings and you got the gold seed beads as well now these are the actually these are the pf colors so these are like the expensive um gold seed beads but look how well they go together i just really do love it um, and he's asking, can someone explain about the stars um, that can be spent? So um, on Facebook, you can send stars for um, your favorite creators and basically stars like turn into money. So I think 100 stars is about a pound. So it's just a way to give your favorite creator a tip or like, you know, like <laughs> for, a, for a cup of coffee or, or something like just just think about it that way. And um, like we whatever we get on total beads we're saving it up and we will be treating the staff to something later on and i will be treating the other two sarahs as well for a spa day at some point <laughs> hopefully very soon when everything opens up and we can do it and again i choose and this orangey not not quite darker orange so i bent lighter um sort of maybe like a, a honey yellow color of rat tail to go with all of those beads because of course you want the beads to stand out of your rat tail when you make macrame bracelet Oh, uh, you will break that press. Oh, no. Right, next one. Oh, I love this one. Now, with this one, I went backwards and forwards, backwards and forwards with this one. And I take it, put colors in, and then I take it out colors, and I put other colors back in. This is called pink magenta. So, when it first started, this one was more of a magenta color. So, the colors were more darker in there than lighter. And then I was, like, sort of thinking and swapping things about. I, I realized that I'm going to have to add some some lighter colors in there because like if you need the contrast, you need the you need to be able to like if, if you especially if you're doing hugs and kisses, if you're doing a darker background, you want something light to put on the top of it. <laughs> so I have changed this one quite a few times, but the and then it was supposed to be only magenta, but it turned into pink magenta. Look at those crystals. They are su such a nice light pink, but they all go nicely together. I have added the rose gold findings and the seed beads you're getting with here is like a, a pink magenta color, sort of somewhere in the middle. 
so it's really nice to like really nice to go together again you got like they're more like a little bit more coppery colors these magnetic findings because they do not they only come in five colors actually but they will go nicely with your and i charge and i choose in a darker rat tail to go with it all um some of them but it, this is the this is the beauty of it that we put all the colors together for you so you have um, everything there to make beautiful jewelry my choice for girls I mean, is saying that's that's it you haven't even seen the purples <laughs> the, this is pink magenta i got three purple colorways i just couldn't stop myself and simon said to him like why do you have to have so many colors and i said well well because we do <laughs> right next colorway coming up shall we look at purple then like um this is this is this is this is so pretty as well this is really really pretty this is one of my favorite so we called this colorway lilac now you have got some lighter ones and you've got some darker ones in there as well there's your crystals the crystals are slightly a little bit smaller in this one than um in the um, other ones it's just because how the colors came out together you get this really lovely lilac color seed beads with it again size six size eight size eleven and you get rose gold finding because i think that was the one which has gone the best with it together simon can I have a your water please <laughs> sorry my <laughs> oh, we got we had no milk this morning in the warehouse you have to pop out and get some after the live so i, I haven't ha haven't had the coffee yet right eye pins and hat pins again air wires and then you got your clothes cream beads jump rings and lobster clasp to do your necklaces all in rose gold again you have got your tiger tail you got your Excuse me, you got your, I'm just going to brain that down, just taking a sip of my water. Elastic. You got your elastic. You got a lovely little um, sipple on there, size D, and also your magnetic findings. And I and I choose in a lilac color, so this one blends in most of it with your beads. But 10, be 10, 10 strands of glass beads and then 4 strands of crystals. Should be £50, £24.99 today. By the sale, with, oh, so <laughs> Simon just giving me the peacock. And I know, Diane, you said you got this one. This is the peacock. So I have, oops, hold on. I'm a, I almost sent the camera flying. So the peacock, I love, I love a peacock color. Uh, because you're blending together purples and you're blending together like a tealy color but it's not the normal teal. So let me just grab, can I just grab that teal for a second? So if I'm just going to bring this tail and we're going to go back to the peacock. So this is a proper tail color. In the peacock, you have got, it's still called tail, but it's a little bit more like a dark aqua color because I think that blends better with the purple. And this is why I was going backwards and forwards, backwards and forwards, picking these things up, putting these things down and like, and literally just standing there and taking a string out <laughs> and then putting it back in <laughs> and uh, i was there for like five hours going it all through so this one you get purple and you get this really lovely tealy color beads you get purple seed beads because i somewhat wanted to take it more towards the purple rather than the teal you get your crystals and the findings and everything else is the same you get more like a dark aqua color again a dark turquoise color maybe I, i'm not sh really sure what's the um how do we call this color of the red tail and <laughs> you just got so many colors and so many colors names but it goes perfectly with both of those magnetic clasp again there i have chosen the black findings and the uh the the gunmetal black um magnetic clasp to go with this because it's a very color for a color so you got purples and you got your tails but you don't really want you want the colors to shine through in your jewelry and you don't want your findings to be overpowering so if i would have added a silver one to it John, like, let me just grab the silver out of this one can you see like if i add the silver to it how much the silver stands out from the jewelry and in my opinion the, the we can take the 
findings in two different ways. So we can either blend it into the jewelry, so it's almost like you can't have, they can't see like uh, the finding or, or like that part of it. Or if you want to make a feature of it, then we want it to stand out. But in this time, because I wanted really the colors to shine through and I really wanted those peacock colors to, to sort of brighten up everything, I've chosen to add darker findings with it. But this is, I think, the, like, you know, what I love doing. I love working at colors. I love just, um, picking bits up and just playing with it and, and playing all the strings <laughs> and making a big mess <laughs> in the very house, but making sure the colors all go together. Right, next one. Let's do the teal then, because the teal is right here. Now for the teal, I added silver findings because I, I wanted that really nice and bright. I love, this is one of my favorite colorways, like navy blues, teals, um, this sort of colors are just really, <laughs> and I've got quite a lot of tops in my wardrobe, um, this color, and that aqua color as well. I haven't got many in purple. I think I need to, I used to have purple colors. Actually, maybe I need to go back and, and get some when the shop's open and we'll have to go out. I'm gonna do the thing, what I always do, <laughs> like normal people, they would go out and buy a top and then come home and make a piece of jewelry for it. Right, for me, <laughs> I will make a piece of jewelry <laughs> and then I would go and search the tops. They'll go and search the shops to, for a top to match my jewelry what I made. <laughs> but never mind. So yeah, you need a starting point. It doesn't, st it doesn't stand, doesn't um, matter if you start one by another. I'm just saying I can't decide either. There's so many lovely colors. I still got four more to come. So, teal, again, 10 strands of your glass beads. Oh. I, I did a couple of lighter ones in there to brighten it up. You got some darker ones in there as well, in the crystals. You got some clear ones, you got m some opaque ones as well. And look at this one, this shimmer one, this really looks really nice. Seed beads, the teal seed beads, size six, size eight, size 11. You got your magnetic clasp there is matching the magnetic clasp is matching your all, all everything is matching up together and then you have obviously your hat pins eye pins you can do beautiful beaded chains you have got your air wires colors jump rings lobster clasp and cream beads for your tiger tail elastic as well if you just want to make a quick uh, bracelet or necklace no, no well actually i wouldn't put <laughs> elastic on necklace but if you want to make a quick bracelet and the lovely hank of i've chosen a lighter color because i think the darker color crystals and dark color beads gonna be look really nice on that um rat tail teal color superlon as well and your tiger tail there as well so every single kit every single bundle is the same but um, some of the sorts of some of them will have more six mils and less eight mils of the glass glass beads. Some of them will have more eight mils and less six mils. And some of them will have larger, some of them will have smaller crystals because I wanted to put the colors together and wasn't really worried about because it's a multi-pack and uh, I'm, I'm gonna tell you not now. So what other thing we decided we're gonna send you with the kits. On Thursday, you're gonna receive an email, everybody who orders the kit and we're gonna give you instructions. So you're gonna have the beaded chain <laughs> you're gonna have the popcorn jewelry you're gonna have quite a few instructions there to be able to make with it and if you go back over the last 12 months <laughs> i wanted to say last few months but it's been 12 months it's our one year anniversary then you will be able to watch the video as well so next color this is oh this is one of my favorites again so when you're playing with color you can make colors like even if you don't don't favor that color you can make it to fit you and I, I favor this this is my favorite so <laughs> no, no, no it's not, not not again this color this one is called hint of blue so I added a couple of navy blue colors in there so you have a darker tone as well but then quite a few of them has got lighter just a hint of blue in there the seed beads I added again is just sort of a hint of blue with a with a bit of gray in there and that's why I love when you add like sort of navies very light blues and then you add some gray tones in there it just goes really nicely together but now I could wear this necklace with a white top I could wear it with a navy I could wear it with a light blue I could wear it so many different colors if I made a necklace out of like this tonal beads 
because they are all go together. So I could I could go like baby blue. I could wear it's not quite baby blue, but you could wear it with baby blue if you put add one that one in it. So I love. I really I really do love this is this colorway. I go I go to this colorway quite often. So if you, you know when I I usually call it navy blue, but it or it's usually tends to like sort of trinkle to with all sorts of different techniques with, with you. Um, thank you for the stars. <laughs> I can't see on my scene who sent it, but I'm sure Lucy will me keep me updated just in a sec. Um, thank you so much for the stars. It's really, really appreciated. Right. Again, I added rhodium color findings with this one. I didn't want to add the very shiny silver one because I'm just let me just grab by this. So again if I add the very shiny silver one in there it just really gonna stand out and I wanted to sort of blend in with everything. So I added these rhodium colors, hat pin eye pins, air wires, clots, cream beads, jump rings, lobster clasp, then your tiger tail seed beads you get a little gray a lot little <laughs> it's a full spool of um, superlon your magnetic clasp oh Lucy, Lucy just sent me a message I forgot to post in here but <laughs> but uh, loads have been spending starts thank you so much for the starts it's really really appreciated me and the team we really appreciate it you get your elastic and your lovely I, um, I went for like sort of a more of a grayish color rather than a blue because i think on this gray the blues are going to show up so nice so it's like a medium gray color of rat tail for you right next one. Oh, this one it's like i'm i'm i'm, I'm thinking like oh the, uh, this is this was my favorite <laughs> and then i and i look at the next one i love this one i call this one lavender so this is purples but with a blue tone to them and i added a blue string in there as well this one is blue and this one is more like a baby blue crystal because i wanted to so i, I love mixing purples with blues as well because then again you can wear this top what you're making with purples you can wear it with jeans you can wear it with so multi-usable to oh diane is asking do you sell rooms to store all the beads in <laughs> I don't know, like may maybe we should go into like an and um design a beach shed or something like that and have it made. <laughs> so with this colour, it's more like I call it lavender because this is the this sort of colour is my lavender in, in my garden, like an English lavender colour, um with a few hint of purples. Now the seed beads what I added in here is the tanzanite one. So it's purple with a hint of grey. I, I love it. I use this colour all the time. And then when I was looking at the findings, I thought like, actually the champagne gold goes really nicely with this one. So let's have some packs where we blend the findings in and let's have some packs when the, the color of the finding complements of the color of the beads. So this one is coming with the champagne, all the findings exactly the same, but this one is coming with a champagne, champagne color base. So I love this one. You could do all sorts of different hugs and kisses, beaded chain, um, tiger tail strong necklace if you wanted you could use them as, as smaller ones as spacer beads you could do so many different things right and next one let me just move this out Th is this one sam you moved it here so next one this is what is this called simon what is this baby, pink. baby pink yes i thought it was <laughs> <laughs> the sticker is gone. I've written all the names down, what I named them. This one is called Baby Pink. So what I wanted to do here is put more of like, this is like a little bit of a corally pink, more of like a ballerina slipper, slipper pink <laughs> with some like really nice soft pinks as well. And the colors, I the seed beads I added is a little bit sort of like a medium pink because I want you want the soft pink on top of the medium pink so they can really show up or if you just use the seed beads in between our spacer beads you want them to show up on there so this is sort of the very light pink to medium pink and if i go back and find the magenta where is the magenta i just want to show you what the difference is magenta where are you is it over there Has those col have i showed those colors this is the magenta so you can see 
This one is very light to medium pink, and this one is more sort of medium pink to magenta. Have you showed those colors already? Yeah. yeah. Can you show me the red? Yes. Good. Yes. So baby pink, I love it. And I added silver findings with it because I wanted something really soft with this one. You don't want to. I did look at the rose gold with it, but the rose gold finding when you add next to this very soft pink, it just didn't look right. It just looked like, you know, sometimes colors together can brighten each other or sometimes colors together can make each other dirty in a way like dirty looking so i'm always when i'm adding colors together i'm looking for that that if i add x color with x is it gonna make it shine and complement each other bring it bring each other out even more or is it gonna like make it like nah, like sort of that sort of feeling that like it's a wide but it's not really it's not really sparkling <laughs> Camille says sit on your hands now. <laughs> oh, bless. So, um, yeah. So, again, 10 strands of glass beads, 4 strands of crystals. And then your findings, your seed beads, your lovely little supalon, your magnetic catches, elastic. And I choose in sort of a medium pink, like an innocent pink um, rat tail to go with it. Right, last but not least, again, one of my favorites. I go to this colorway so often, and I, and I added a little bit of twist into this one because aqua is, I got so many tops. I got, uh, this is definitely my color. I'm definitely an aqua girl. But what I wanted to do with this one is instead of just having the aqua, I added like a, a the nebula seed beads in there, which are more like a navy blue dark blue but because these seed beads have got like an aqua shine on them like if i bring it up can you see they go really nicely together and i have used aqua beads a lot with these this color seed beads and then i thought i might as well add this darker rat tail in there as well so your seed beads are your, your beads are really gonna go show on there and a darker Super on to match your seed beads. Now I have added silver finding with this one because the overall, even though we're using darker seed beads, so we you could have get away with a darker color finding. I wanted. I, I think this silver one is really nice and bright against it. It just brightens the color even more. So we darkening the color with the seed beads, but we lightening them with our findings. If that makes sense, so it looks really nice together. You get uh, all the same findings and you get your magnetic clasp on uh, there as well. So don't forget the sale finish midnight tomorrow, which is Wednesday. And on Thursday, we are going to be putting all the kits together. So th they are not limited, but they are limited in a way that we can only make so many of them. <laughs> so, so be sure to go ahead if you if you would like to purchase some of them. And um you know it will be good for so many different techniques and that's what i wanted to do so when i thought about it what can i do for a one year anniversary i was like well we did so many different techniques i'm not really sure which one shall i favor or which 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 one is my favorite really because uh, my favorite technique is always the one i'm working on so <laughs> so if if you think about that one i just wanted to add a bundle together where we can give you an amazing offer and then you can do all sorts of different things this is the teal one um, i'm bringing back in here now another thing what um we want what, what i asked simon to put on offer is our usb bundles because i know if especially if you are new and you want to learn a lot and you want to um, if this is saying i got four bundles oh bless you um the usb itself can you pass me usb simon he's that is gonna run and can you pass me down a, a box of the usb bundle he's he's bringing it so um we wanted to put the usb bundles together actually i'm gonna i'm gonna go full screen on me and then we can um then we can go down and show you the bundles so for the usb bundles and if you are new and you don't know we've been doing the usb so we have added we got four usbs together 
so far. Now, the first USB was the beginner's guide to beading, which had 30 projects on there, that, but only about four or five projects had videos. And then we really listened after we released that first USB, that what you really wanted and what the feedback was that you wanted more video. So with the second USB, we went in with 20 projects, but every single project had a video in there. And that's the format we kept for the third and the fourth one as well. And Simon just gonna bring me um, a sample so I can show you. And even more, what we did, so on the USB itself, so this is the USB on, um, I, I, I'm so, and the Simon just bought in the bundle, so I'm going to go back down to the, the table. So this is the USB itself. You, most of you have seen the USB. It has got a USB attachment on one side, which yet then you can open up and then it goes into a micro USB attachment. So this is for your Androids. That's one is a, um, for your laptops, your computers. And on the other side, you got your lightning cable attachment, which is uh, your iPhones, iPads, etc. There is also a little dongle comes with it where um, you can connect to even more devices. So the USB on its own, you can you can purchase it on its own. It's got all the data, got about between 70 and 80 printable PDFs on there for you. Um, you can print it out if you like, or if you can just work off from the USB itself. But when we did the USBs, what we actually did is we add, we made a big bundle of beads. This one is, this one is USB four, isn't it, Simon? No, is it, no, it's three. This is USB three. So we made kit to go with every single project on the USB itself. This one is project 19, you got project 18. Let me just open this bag up. So if you really want to learn and if you want to be specific about it, then you can go. Now the bundle comes with the USB itself and usually it's, it's 200 pounds today down to 130 pounds for USB 3 and USB 4. Those are the ones we have stock of it and we have got limited stock of these. So if you do want to have a look and you do want to take advantage of it, um, you can. Now the USB bundle obviously is 20 kits and it's all, all the materials there. You get needles and thread as well um, included in there to make, to work along the USB itself. So that, that, that could be an option for you if you wanted to, or if you wanted to buy it somebody as a gift, this is a complete like sort of jewelry making kit. And quite a few of the ladies, I know Lucy, you got all four of them and um, some of the other people got all four of them as well. That is just a really nice way to sort of make along and do all the, uh, because sometimes when you have a bundle, you might have to think of like, am I going to do number one or am I going to do number two or am I going to do number five because I haven't got all the materials enough for each one of those. So I'm just pop back here. So I got, you got my face back on there. So what we wanted to do is to put one together where you got enough materials to do every single project in there. So that's it. Happy anniversary, everybody. I hope you enjoyed today. I just wish my staff wouldn't be so, so shy, but hey ho, they <laughs> they you can't can't I uh, can't change them. I can't I can't force them to come on to to say hello. They're all saying hello in in their hearts, I guess. Bless them. Thank you so much for supporting us last year. It has been a roller coaster of the year for loads of us and i'm just like i'm looking forward to the next year and <laughs> i'm gonna get emotional now we've been bundling up things and we've been working i've got all four usb joey's saying as well um we've been doing so much oh look just blake just walked behind me hey. there you go <laughs> he just said hey <laughs> so that, that, that's all you're gonna get at him bless him um i'm looking forward to next year we got different plans we definitely will be a bit more strategic like what we're doing and where we're doing it and how we're doing it and we will be like more to <laughs> Ruth is saying i need to rub, rub, rob a bank now oh bless we will be like you know I, I last year i really went into the thick of it and by the summer i felt like i was burning out because we were going live every day and we need to scale it back so I think we're definitely going to keep the four days going forwards because that's sort of what realistically I can do or we can do. So 
I'm really looking forward to next year and I'm hoping next year on the 20th, doesn't matter what day is it going to be, next year on the 23rd of March we will, we will come live and, um, and celebrate our second anniversary like going live and we just change I think we just embraced it like you know as, as they say when life gives you lemons you need to make lemonade and I think that's what we th that's what we did we, we just made we just made the most of it what we can and I always said last year like tore us apart but it brought us together I made so many friends I got a lady in San Diego who I talk like talk with it like on FaceTime with her like on a weekly basis I got like you know other ladies as well around the world and even in the UK like the lovely Natalie I, I talked to her the Joe and and all, all people like Lucy that I never I would have never met if we didn't start this last year so I'm so happy that we came together as a community so that's it. Thank you everybody to supporting us, um, to supporting me as a designer, to supporting Sarah as a designer, the, the Sarah Millsop, oh, I have to, <laughs> so to say Sarah Millsop and Sarah Payne as well as a designer, supporting us Totally Beats as a company. It has been a lovely year and be looking forward to another one. So beading together, crafting together, doing all sorts of things together. Thanks everybody. Have a lovely day. I will be back tomorrow with you at 10 a.m. And we're going to be doing a beaded chain, actually. So take care, everybody. And i see you soon. Just just the last word to this bundle. is only on there until tomorrow night. And then we will take it off because we're going to gather all the materials and make it up. And it's, I'm going to be making them up personally. So you can. Uh, I will be overseeing the, the colorway. So they're going to be amazing. See you later, everybody. Have a good day. Keep on beading. Keep on crafting. Bye.